Fauci's been doing. This was ominous congressional testimony about the spread of COVID-19 in the U.S. It puts the entire country at risk. We are now having 40 plus thousand new cases a day. I would not be surprised if we go up to 100,000 a day if this does not turn around. And so I am very concerned. Dr. Fauci suggested several states were reopening too quickly. Arizona, California, Florida and Texas are all having to rethink their reopening plans as cases spike. The U.S. still lags in testing, contact tracing, social distancing and mask usage. White House health advisors bemoan this in their testimony. And I'm not satisfied with what's going on because we're going in the wrong direction if you look at the curves of the new cases. So we've really got to do something about that and we need to do it quickly. Short answer so to your question is that clearly we are not in total control right now. A recurring theme was a lack of concern among sections of the population who refused to take even minimum protections for themselves and others, and their suspicion of science in general. But senators also repeatedly criticized a president who refuses to wear a mask and has been urging a return to normality. These two parallel messaging operations, and I just think it's worth stipulating that um, everything we're hearing today is responsible, it's based on evidence. but. The agencies represented here today have social media followings of about 5 million people. The President of the United States has a social media following of 82 million. President Trump's opponent in the forthcoming election seized upon similar themes during a speech in his hometown of Wilmington, Delaware. The President gives no direction, and he pits us against one another. We can't continue like this, half recovering and half getting worse. We can't continue half wearing masks and half rejecting science. But in fact, there is now consensus among the Republican leadership that mask wearing should be encouraged, something the White House press secretary said the president has no issue with. The president has said he has no problem with masks, that uh, he encourages people to make whatever decision is best for their safety and to follow what their local jurisdictions say. Yet the president is expected at Mount Rushmore on Friday to mark the beginning of the Independence Day weekend. Officially, there will be no attempt at social distancing and masks will not be mandatory. Shea Al Jazeera, Washington.